to my channel so it's officially about to be summer so you know what time it is oh that's loud spring empties um spring was really interesting so in this video it's gonna be a little bit different so i'm gonna um show you what i empty in the spring and i'm not gonna show you my entire body care because i don't want to make this video forever i'm only gonna show what's different um any different products um other than what i already showed y'all in my um body care videos um i'll link it right here or right here um let's get into it so i'm gonna start with body washes okay so i've used the multivitamin daily nutrients body wash by naturium um this is like the glow getters spring summer sister um it's really hydrating but it's not as you know oily or hydrating as a glow getter so i like this very much for the warmer months um i did get another one the trim just had a sale their first sale on their website so i re upped all my stuff got some new stuff drop the base main the base yeah. Yeah. Follow me on Instagram. I'll put my Instagram channel right here. But um, yeah, I like this very much. This one was a oldie but a goodie. It's the Nectarium, the Soother Sister Body Wash. This is my Dove Sister Scare replacement. And if you know, you know, the bar is like really um, non scented, but like the um, the actual, no, the liquid, the, um, the shower gel is actually slightly scented. So I like this so much, like, especially like, if you want to, when you want to cleanse your body before you exfoliate your body, this is a really good one. Like, I really like it. Like, they had a, um, in that short, it was half off. So, I bought two of them. And I thought they was going to, like, um, not sell them out anymore, but they're back in stock. So, I got these for $8, and that was definitely, definitely a steal. And this one was a new one. It's the Naturium, the Softener Creamy Clay Body Wash. Um, I want to say they released this back in March, April. Some early time in spring. And I like it a lot. When they say it softens your body, they really definitely mean that. Um, it says leather, mild format, clay cream, and use silky creamy after feel smooth i mean soft that's smooth and it really does like i've been trying to get rid of the um the french cashmere cashmere glow or something like that something cashmere but the the fragrance is um really irritating to my skin and i mix this with that one baby best shower experience ever um i might bring that back i don't know but really good shower experience. Um, when I did purchase this from their website, I did buy two. The only thing is that they no longer sell this on their website, which I don't like about Naturium. Like they will offer stuff and next thing you know, it's gone. Like, come on. When I didn't see this on their website for a second, I was like really upset because this is, this is my staple, but they did bring it back. But I didn't see this one. So hopefully they bring it back. But if they don't, I'm not really... Um, worried about it um these two could be sisters because this lather is low gentle and this lather is mild so that's how i would compare the two so like a a really um a good clean without a really good lather so if like a lot of lather irritates skin these would be really good for you i'm gonna go with my body exfoliators and i like tree height and body by tph like i said this thing so good the only thing i don't like is squeezing out the last of it but it is so good like oh my gosh your skin will feel soft the day of and soft the days after because it has chemical exfoliants in it 
This one is just an OD but a goodie. It's a little bit, um, it's a harsher scrub than um, Body by TPH, but I like it because it's a really good exfoliating, um, exfoliator, like a, a scrub. So I will always gravitate in between these two. So I don't know if I shared this. I think I did share it in my spring um, body care video, but um, my best friend made a butter and, um, we ran through the first one. Well, me and hubby ran through the first one. Well, me and hubby got one, but we ended up using it for Josie because she has like really bad eczema. And we ran through it for Josie so fast. And when I say this thing is just so moisturizing, it's so loving on your skin. Josie only, Josie's skin only likes like um, Mustela products or Aquaphor. So for us to be able to use something else was a really good plus. Um, he sold this to us, it was like one for 15 and two for 25. So if you're interested, I'll leave his channel either here or here or definitely in the description box. Um, he's on Instagram. It was just so good. Like, oh my gosh. Um, when I show you my, um, body care, I'll definitely show you the new one he got us. He said he put aloe vera in it and it is just, it melts right in your hand. That butter is so good. So this is um, my um, contact solution. I use the BioTru Hydration Plus. It is the best contact solution. Like, all right. So after this, we have our face care. So this is my OD but goodie. When I started um, taking care of my face, I've always used this. It's the Thayer's Facial Toner Witch Hazel with um, what well, it says Aloe Vera Formula, and the fragrance is Rose Petal. So hydrating, but yet cleans your face and it, um, you know, adjusts the pH of your skin. And I always get the job done, so I always come back to this one. Next, I have the Rose Water Toner Moisturizing Essence. And I use it as an essence. And oh my gosh, this thing is so good. I saw somebody using this on, I forgot what channel it was. But I saw somebody using this. I was like, because I had rose water at the time, like just pure rose water, not the essence. I was like, I've never thought about that. So I started using rose water as my essence. But then when I, once I realized that she was actually using this and I started using this, OMG. This preps your skin for serums really well. And when I say it's like $10 on Amazon, this is a really good essence. Do you my serums? So all my serums are Natrium. This is the Vitamin C Complex Serum. Um... I don't know if I like this better than like the other vitamin C serums, but I did see some difference in my face, maybe because I was using like all these um different ones in conjunction with this, but um, she's cute. It's definitely better than getting like a $60 bottle of um, you know, vitamin C serum or like a $40 bottle or even $20 bottles. I think this was like $15, $16, but um, Nothing to write home about. I'm going to definitely show you something different that I got that I'm never going to um, not use. It's going to be one of my staples, but that's for later time in this video. So just hold tight. This is the Niacinamide Serum 12% plus Zinc um, 2%. And it says Niacinamide 12% Zinc PCA 2% hyaluronic acid and vitamin e this was my bad boy for night time like when i tell you this thing was so good and it says um it was zinc in it to help with like acne so good like it was just so nurturing to my skin um but i found something different um and this was this is their um basic um hyaluronic acid it says quadruple hyaluronic acid serum five percent and it's hyaluronic acid at four molecular weight levels i love this too like your skin was just was just hydrated and just supple but i did find something else that has hyaluronic acid in it but i really like this like if you don't get anything any other serum from the i would definitely suggest you to try this one 
and then <laughs> and then it's this one this is my ride or die i might just stick with this one but i'll wait for um something else to run out this is the multi-bright tranex tranexamic acid treatment five percent and it says tranexamic acid five percent plus encapsulate kojic acid and alpha arbutin this stuff when i use this like i had definitely have like hyperpigmentation that i'm working with like we gotta get it under bay um i have the type of skin that you know has more hyperpigmentation than others but um when i say i saw so much progress with this like it's definitely on my one of my loves for like treating hyperpigmentation because i saw so much progress like with this one i saw progress but it was kind of slow but this one baby like it was just like it was happening like i was like oh we getting somewhere and uh, just a couple other stuff oh and this is my flossers i have a permanent retainer and um I have to use flossers to floss that stuff. If you have a permanent retainer, please floss your teeth because you can get gingivitis and you don't want that in your life. Um, so I just get it from Amazon. It comes really cheap. And you definitely you definitely need flossers to floss your teeth if you have like braces or like permanent retainers. So I'll probably put the link right here, right here. And of course, Aqua 4 for lips. Always get the job done. This was my acne spot treatment of choice this is the clean and clear advantage acne spot treatment really good acne spot treatment i tried something different i should have got this again but it is what it is high size 2020 but um this would definitely be like a staple for um acne treatment and this i used to say all under eye creams were the same once I use this, baby, it changed the game. It changed the game. When I say like I use every last bit of it and the best part of it was this one, this applicator right here, because what you're supposed to do, you're supposed to squeeze it and then rub it under your eye. And this metal tip feels so good. Oh my, this was the best part of my um, face skin routine. But let me tell you what it is though. It is the Teen Again Eye Cream with Peptide and Retinol. Yeah, it it was, it did its thing. And I want to say it was $6, around 6 to $13 at TJ Maxx. And I went back to TJ Maxx to try to find it and I couldn't. So I was kind of sad, but I did sit, but I did see other stuff from the brand. What's this brand? Um... It says, look at me. Um, and it's a Korean brand. Um, I don't know what, maybe it's Teen again. I don't know what brand it is. If I find the brand, I'll put it right here, right here. But this was really good. And you can get it for, you can get it for a really good price from TJ Maxx. So if you find this, grab it. Okay, that's it for my spring empties slide. <laughs> um, this is just the pump because my kid got to it. So this was the Neutrogena Hydro Boost um, face wash. And um, I used that in the winter. And I um, I guess I used it up towards the springtime. Um, and it's a really good face wash for like, you know, winter it's harsh outside, it's cold outside, so you want to bring more hydration back in. Um, and I liked it a lot. So I'll put the bottle right here or right here as usual. Okay, so what's different in my skincare and my body care routine? So let's go in the same order, body to lay face care. Trinium, KP, KP body, body scrub and mask. And it says it has AHA, BHA, PHA body exfoliator. It's fragrance free. It says it has 8% glycolic acid, 0.5% salicylic acid, 2% PHA plus jojoba esters. And it's a smell. I mean, I you know I like stuff that's fragrance free in the shower. Yeah, so it does it definitely have pumice in it as opposed to like 
you know, scrubs typically have like sugar in it. So it's more of an, it's a rougher exfoliant because, you know, when you rub your body with the sugars, they eventually dissolve. Don't use this bad boy forever. You can wear your skin like that. But I was, I was kind of put off because it's like, let me use it. It's really thick. And you see, like, it's really white. And it can get stuck in, like, the most random places. But when I felt my skin the days after I use it, because, you know, it has chemical exfoliants in it. And chemical exfoliants take a while for them to work. They might be on to something. Because my skin is really soft. <laughs> um, I think I could get around the jojoba smell. Um, if you smell jojoba, you know, like, it's a particular smell. Like, it's a very particular smell. But for the results, I think I can get around it. And it's a, um, it's a fragrance-free, um, exfoliator. Um, the only thing is the mask is very thick. And it, it takes a lot of work for you to for it to wash off your body, but for the results, I don't know. They might they might be onto something. And this was sold on the website, and they were like they were so hyped when they said, "Oh, it's back in stock." They might have a good reason why. So, if you want to check this out, I definitely recommend. It definitely does smell like a whole but Don't act like I didn't tell y'all, cause this thing got smell on it. So this is a new body wash for me. This is an Atrium the Purifier Niacinamide Serum Body Wash. And it says balances, soothes, and replenishes moisture. So I'm definitely looking forward to it. It says the leather is rich and dynamic. The format is gel serum. And use is, excuse me, is um, gentle and silky. The after feel is clean and refreshed. That's not a feel. Like, how do you... I mean, I guess I'll get it once I use it, but that's not a feel. <laughs> but um, I'm definitely excited because they haven't missed. They haven't missed on any of their... And of course, it says it's fragrance-free. And it's um, niacinamide 2% plus PCA glycerol oleates and glycerin. So it's definitely going to make your body feel soft. But they haven't missed so far when they body they body wash it. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like it. This is supposed to be empty. Um, I definitely didn't get some more. So oh, I definitely gotta show that too. So um, Body by TPH launched some new stuff. They have um, this. They have body sprays now. Um, it was some other stuff they launched. But um, this is one of them. This is their control and delete. A blemish targeting body serum with lactic acid and the scent is bergamot and neroli i don't know if i'm saying that right but i hope so and when i say this thing is so good and your skin will feel so soft after using it the only thing is that you have to use it the proper way like you have to put your body serum on and then put on your technically then put on your lotion then put on your, like your your thicker you know locking moisture stuff like your body oils or your body creams or your um your butters but um when you use it the proper way it's so good but i'm a mom i don't have a lot of time to get ready in the morning most days i don't have time to be putting this on and then putting on my um butter i mean body oil gel and lotion mix so i definitely just use this in like my personal areas and under my arms and then put on like deodorant stuff um it's really good. I'm definitely going to buy this one instead of the, uh, which one I was using, the Gillette one. I forgot what it's called. But um, the Gillette one, I'm going to get this one. But, you know, she partnered with Walmart. <laughs> and Walmart's always out of stuff, out of stock with everything, like even on their website. So who knows if, I, if I'm even going to be able to find this. But I hope so, because it's really good. But if I don't find it, I definitely just... We'll get the Gillette, the Gillette one, and that one's fragrance for anyway. And this one, it does have a fragrance. It's like fruity. I forgot. Let me tell you what it has. 
Blemish Swag Control Alt Delete harnesses the power of kojic acid to help promote the look of an even skin tone, black charcoal to help clean out the impurities and clog out pores, and lactic acid to help exfoliate the skin. So it's definitely like on the gray side. That's when I first saw it on the um, Instagram. I was like, oh, okay. But it definitely works well. So um, I'm almost out of this. Like I can't pump it anymore. The only thing I don't like is that the pump is it's slippery. It's hard to pump the stuff out. So um, would it stop me from using it? Definitely not. But um, I hope I can buy this. If not, I'll just get the Gillette one face wash um i like the cetaphil ones um this is the one i usually use it's a cetaphil daily facial cleanser for um combination to oily sense of skin and um it's just a gentle cleanser i use this in the morning when i know i have a sweat i'm not gonna wash off sunscreen or i'm just like removing my night products and putting on my morning products it's a gentle cleanse it's not gonna strip your skin and um it just gets the job done, but very gently. This is a new one. This is the Hydrating Formant Cream Cleanser. Dry to normal sense of skin. And baby, this is so good. Like, I really like it. Like, it's really cleansing. It's really, um, it's a really good lather. Pleasantly surprised. But this is almost out, I want to say, it's like right here. So when this runs out, I got this for half off from the Cherry website from their sale. This is the Mixed Greens Nutrient Rich Cleanser and it has a vitamin C green tea aloe. And I'm very excited to try this. Like I haven't tried any of their, their facial cleansers, only their serums, their body washes. I did try the lotion. I don't know where it is. Oh, it's in my travel bag. The lotion is pretty good as well. But um excited to try it. Um this is their essence. I got this from half off, but I did originally buy it from Amazon for full price. And when I bought it for half off, guess who took it back to um, Amazon? Me. But <laughs> I got some of it out and put it in my toiletry bag. And it is so moisturizing. It's just, I love it. And it says hyaluronic acid, essence, 2% skin optimizing treatment with 2% hyaluronic acid and um it's just a great prop to put your serums on because it's really hydrating and you just know like the serum is just going to sit really well on your skin if i'm exfoliating my skin i don't use any serums because it could really irritate your skin learn it the hard way um learn from my pain my lessons but um i don't put any serums on my skin i just let it be the only thing for a day and I put my moisturization on. Um, so I have two options. This is the ordinary AHA, BHA two, AHA three percent, BHA two percent peeling solution, and it says it's a ten minute exfoliating facial PHA three point six. And when I say this is like ten dollars, this is so good. Like I can't use it in the winter because it's really harsh for me for the winter. But these warmer months. This thing been hitting. Um, I don't use the full 10 minutes. I'll use like five minutes. But when I say the next morning, my face is just so soft. And I feel like it's just a whole new layer of skin on my face. Good. This one is really good. Ordinary was on to something. And if I don't have a lot of time, like I'm just, my kids are just acting crazy. And I just need to get my face done and run out the bathroom, find out what they're doing. This is what I use. It's a glycolic acid resurfacing gel, 10%. Um, it says AHA exfoliant gel with 10% glycolic acid. I don't remember how much this is, but for the amount that they give you, very much worth your price. Like the pump is very big um, and it's a really big bottle. This is three fluid ounce. Like, you know, your standard um, serum is like one fluid an ounce, but it is a really big bottle. It's lasting me a really long time and it gets the job done. Like your skin feels so soft the day after. I love this thing very much. The only reason I gravitate towards 
This one is because it has, it's an AHA plus BHA. Let me see what it has. Yeah, I don't know what it has, but if I find it, um, I'll put it up here. But I know the BHA is always salicylic acid. And that's the important thing because, you know, salicylic acid goes deeper in your skin than AHAs. And that's the only reason why if I do have time, I use this. Or even better, I use like the um, Aztec clay and um, apple cider vinegar if you really have time. Um, but just for five minutes, the, the results you get for using this five minutes, bomb. The serums, I got this one. This is the Vitamin C Super Serum Plus. It has vitamin C, vitamin A, hyaluronic acid, niacinamide, salicylic acid, baby. <laughs> this thing is everything to me. Like, it has everything you need. Your vitamin C, vitamin A is retinol, um, hyaluronic acid, salicylic acid for like your, um, it's a BHA and it helps like, you know, prevent breakouts and niacinamide. And every time I use this, my skin feels so soft the day after. I'm never going back. This is always going to be my morning serum and it's going to be a ride or die. Like we riding with this until they don't sell it no more. Hopefully they will sell it forever so I can continue to buy it. And at night for now, I'm using the Alpha Arbutin Serum. Um, it's nothing to write home about. I'm just using it. To, I'm just using it until I use it up. Um, my, preference, my preference right now is the Tranexamic Acid. But I'm not going to waste this. So I'm going to use this up and then purchase the either the Tranexamic Acid, the um, the cream one, the one that I just got rid of, or they have another one on their website. Either one of those two. But um, it's okay. Mix anything with rosehip oil. And rosehip oil has a lot of good stuff in it. Um, one of the things I definitely know they has is vitamin C. But I'll put the rest of the stuff it has in it. But mix anything with this one and it will just chef's kiss locking everything that you put on your skin in. This is a day moisturizer um, for right now. And I like it a lot. Like it really gets the job done. The size that you get is really good. And price wise, I think this was like $20. Yeah, it's a really good option for me. This is La Roche Posay um, Tolerine Double Repair Face Moisturizer UV Bar Spectrum SPF 30 with ceramide and niacinamide. They put in niacinamide and everything. I don't know why. And it says La Roche Posay Prebiotic Thermal Water. And it's a really good moisturizer plus SPF. Um, the SPF doesn't show up, um, doesn't give it a white cast. And um, I usually use this and um, two drops of the rosehip oil. I like this a lot and it only takes a little bit and you get so much. Like the um, Miele, Miele has one that I was using too, but it was like $20 for that small tube. And this one is definitely bigger. I don't know, it's 3.38 fluid ounces. I'll definitely be rebuying, it, rebuying this to be my, um, my day moisturizer. My eye cream, I picked this up from TJ Maxx. So when I went in there and I didn't see that it had teen again, I had to buy something. Like, I need an eye cream. Like, I'm in my 30s, you know, to prevent, you know, the creases, the bags, and, you know, sleep is not the greatest. Got two toddlers. But um, this is one that makes me think, like, any eye cream is just eye cream. This is the OOTD. Intensive eye serum and it has hyaluronic acid, vitamin C, and caffeine. Um, I like it, but it's definitely more watery than like the teen again or the other um under eye creams I've used before. But it's really good. Like once it dries down, um, I can really see the difference in my under eye and my eye appearance because I definitely use it on my under eyes and my top lid as well. But um, I definitely see it. Um. I thought it was gonna last a long time. You know your eye creams, they last forever because that your under eye and your eye area is only but so big. But um I think it's going pretty fast. So I don't know. I definitely got two of them. There's another one in an orange bottle. If I can find it, I'll put it somewhere on the screen. But um 
yeah, I'm pleasantly surprised with this. I want to say this was five to seven dollars at TJ Maxx. I like to get my eye creams at TJ Maxx because I, at the end of the day, an eye cream is an eye cream. If you're just beginning with your face products and you just dabbling in different stuff, go to TJ Maxx. They have, you know, good products, the products you recognize in like Sephora or like Ulta or even um, on Amazon, and it'd be severely discounted. So I would start there, dabble there, and then you know, figure out what you want, what you like, what you want to use, and then start buying at other places. These are my night creams. This is CeraVe Skin Renewal Night Cream Peptide Complex Plus. Um, I like it, especially when I mix it with the rosehip oil. Um, it's very thick it sits on your face nicely but what i did realize is that i have to use a moisturizer before i put my night creams on because if i don't it doesn't sink into my skin properly because these things are so thick and for me i realized like thicker creams doesn't really work well on my skin um unless i use like uh something with more water in it before so this one is a really good option and has um yeah, it has three essential ceramides plus niacinamide. Of course, they put niacinamide in everything, but um, it's a really good one. And I'm almost out. So I also picked up at the same time the Intensive Overnight Sleeping Cream from Natrium. And it's a really thick boy as well. Like, let me see. she thick <laughs> homegirl thick but um i think it will work well especially the way i use it and um i don't know um i definitely tell you what i think about it in my summer empties or my fall empties but um i think it will do well Next one I have is these emergency acne patches, invisibly covered blemishes. And I like this one because it has tea tree oil in it. And it says tea tree oil to soothe and calm and heal. Um, and you know the other ones are just the you know the patches, but this is the patches, plus it has tea tree oil in it, and I definitely see the results. Like the pimple, if it's not gone, it's considerably it's considerably smaller in size. Um I'll definitely recommend this over like the regular pimple patches. This is like the moisturizer I've been using um, as of right now. This is the Cetaphil Deep Hydration Healthy Glow Daily Cream. Hydrosensitive Complex plus hyaluronic Acid. And I like it. It reminds me of like, I don't know what it's called, but it's the Hydro Boost. It's like, you no know, extra strength or like extra moisturizing or double moisture. I think it's called double moisture. Um, because that one for me it was you no know, not fragrance and you know Cetaphil they don't have fragrances in their products but it's really really moisturizing like I was really surprised with this and it was from a price standpoint it's definitely cheaper than um Hydro Boost Neutrogena um and it's really good so definitely Cetaphil deep hydration if you see this buy it all right guys that's it um thank you for watching if you like content like this um please give me a like and subscribe especially if you're a return viewer and have a subscribe what are you waiting for like join the tile of madness um and i definitely like doing um videos like this because no i'm not gonna travel everywhere like i want to i'm not gonna do everything that i want to because toddlers are expensive but I'm going to do something that's going to bring me some joy, make my life um, luxurious um, some type of way. And for me right now, that's making videos for you guys, um, doing things that please me, that is not, um, you know, expensive in the finance department, um, and body and face care. Okay, guys. Thank you. Bye.